So what do you think of the house? I'm excited to have you stay with me. Oh, I can't wait for the girls to come up here and see this. How many times will the words cabaret be said? That's a fun game. My god, that's the drinking like game. We take a shot. We'll be blackout. We'll go and rehab ourselves. We're concerned that you're now this big cabaret star. Yeah. But you can't forget who you're Friends are. I don't. By the way, by the way, you're the way. sitting in my house right now. May I you're remind you? you. So you better watch yourself. I'm sexually fluid. Like I'll just take what's ever in front of me. Is that true? Depends really, they have to be hot. She's had. I mean, I was a little surprised. I moved the performance from midnight. I was I a came. little. I came. But you always say you have to get home for Bryn. Right. At 11 o'clock at night, the child is sleeping. I'm a mom. I come I know home. That. I'm a I, mom too. I, you're you not don't a talk mom. to me like I'm not a mom. Rhinebeck's not that far. That's where the hotel is. We're going to Rhinebeck. Have you been to Rhinebeck? You're not. You're, you're staying not. here. We're going no, to No, we're Rhinebeck. going out tonight. I thought you said Kingston. We're going to go to Rhinebeck for dinner and Kingston for out after. What's out oh. after? Oh, God. It's, it's a woman called Margarita, OK? She's from uh, Cuba. OK. And she plays the keyboards. OK. And she's 80. How many times will the words cabaret be said? That's a fun game. That's, That's the really drinking good. game. Yeah. And wow. she's hysterical. Lou didn't say cabaret. But it still counts, right? I mean, I'm type A. I follow the rules. So I'm going to drink all the wine I can, just in case, because I didn't come here to make friends. I came here to win the cabaret drinking game. And she wears her feather boas and her glitz. And that's why I said, just bring anything. It's fun. She sings. She forgets the words. I didn't she bring keeps feathers going. Or I told her. No one was bringing I feathers. I have extra stuff. No one's bringing oh. feathers. You brought feathers? I, no, I brought a little fur. Right. When the counter sweater. says feathers and uh, sparkles, it's like, oh. It's a lot. I think I've got something for you. Let me see. Luann, are you taking a look into your future here? Money can't uh, get class. Who's out there? Is anybody out there? That's funny. Am I allowed to not want to go to cabaret? I had never been to a cabaret in my whole life, and I was OK. Cute. Yeah, yeah, perhaps. Perhaps. But I'm OK. I don't, I'm all right. But the, yeah, maybe. I'm having an out-of-body experience right now. And I'm not even drinking. And I don't know why not. Also, Luann has signature necklaces that can sparkle up anything. OK, good. A couple are amazing. OK. Who were you for Halloween again? I was Slash. I laughed so much when I saw I you. felt very comfortable in that outfit. I felt like, Great. you know, a second skin. Like, I really felt like it was a part of me. A like second skin? Is that a foreskin? I, I, <laughs> <laughs> Something like that. It was a really good party. It's Where were you the whole night? I, I was in the suite getting I was ready, getting ready. Like ready. a star does. I need five minutes, and then we're going to go down. Another five minutes? How do you do this, Luann? Two minutes. What time is it? But you uh, never came you know. down the whole night. It was no, terrible. No, no. All the girls were upset. Oh, okay. now I'm getting the 911. We're concerned that you're now this big cabaret star. Yeah. And spending and no time with us. Oh, come on. You're yeah. going to forget me your break. friends. Yeah, I was no, with I... you guys for a while. And no, then I, had to no. Go up and get I don't think you were No, with us. you weren't. That's I a was. figment of your what? imagination. You never came. Well, I was rehearsing with the dancers. But not so us. So that's what you never came no, to say hi to Bethany. And, that, and you know when she has Bryn, she doesn't go out at all. Well, no, well no, she's going to no, wait no, in 10 more no, minutes. No, Come no. on. So what did you say? You said you're going to go home and watch Bryn sleep? What? I don't know. Bryn I can't sleep? remember. <laughs> I would think that on Halloween night at 11 o'clock or 12 o'clock at night that the child is sleeping in any case. So what's the rush? No, that I said, oh, you're going home to watch your daughter sleep was horrible compared to the things she said to me in the past? Come on. It's not that big of a deal. You are a slut and a liar and a hypocrite. Oh, very nice. And a snake. Say it again that I was dating a married man while I was in his house. You are married and he's you married. Are, you are a liar. You're a horrible you person. You are born a liar and you are die a liar. I'm getting <laughs> for it. We for not even with wait, her. having my friends we wait for me to perform, that. for God's sake. Yeah. Can't I straight. can't believe that this. I go on stage, I'm performing. It's a big night and my friends can't wait. 15 minutes for me to perform. Give me a break. No, she's acting like a celebrity. Show up at this spot. Oh, you, you know what? By the, abuse, way, by the way, you're sitting in my house right now. May I Warning remind you, you that eating at my table. So you better watch point. yourself, girl. I might be out with the dog, but <laughs> you better watch it. But at least I'm truthful. Those girls truthful. are not telling what about you having my back once in well, a while? Well, I'm a Sagittarius. I tell the truth. I want you to know what the girls are saying. I love Sonya. She gives me a fair warning that the ladies are not happy with me, and I just wonder how much she's been a part of that conversation and how much she's had my back. You 
really came to my rescue in so many ways. And I just like, I feel like. One more thing. No, I think, no, it'd be nice to have you celebrate the good things that happened to me, like performing, you know what I mean? I was like what you do? looking for Luann, I'm a mother of an eight-year-old in third grade. It's I Halloween. Know. I was trick-or-treating after school. No, but really, hear me. I need you to actually receive this. Right. I'm a mom. I come I know home. That. I'm a I, mom too. I, you're Don't not a talk mom. to me like I'm not a mom. I know what well, it is. Well, you're not a mom of an eight-year-old because Well, I have been a mom of an eight-year-old. Well, so I you can told relate. me when we were in Miami at Art Basel that I should just get somebody to take care of my kid at night when I don't want to do that. Well, well yeah, when you want to go out. But I don't sure. want to so go out at 11. But I don't want to go out at 11 30 at night. I don't I, I wouldn't go to Madonna you. at 11 30 at night. I moved the performance from midnight. I was I little, came. I know I'm glad you're at 11 30. I came for three and a half hours. Like I don't think you're hearing me. Oh, you always say you have to get home for Brent. At eleven o'clock at night, the child Sleeping. But normally you wouldn't so you call him to get at all. But I have to wake up with her to take her to make her breakfast and take her to school. This is my life. No, You're I doing understand. your cabaret and your life, and I respect that, and I, I was there supporting that. No, I'm I, living my life, and you're not supporting it by saying to somebody to watch her daughter sleep. This is my life, the way that I'm living it well, right now. Well, guess what? I was not thinking, first of all, I was about thinking anybody about you being there to watch me on stage. Which I came it was to late. do. Yes. And, and it was you late. were late. And it didn't was text us. And so for me, it was like, why should she have to rush out because her daughter's sleeping in any case? Who do you think you are? This is how I'm choosing to do this as a single mom, and I don't like to be f***ed with on it at all. I'm hurt that you would say something negative about the choices that I'm making to go home when I didn't say anything negative about the choices that you're making within your cat. And it actually really did well, hurt I, me, Well, you know, like, I to be just honest. was hurt because you didn't stay to kind of celebrate a but moment for so me. But that's so narcissistic. I'm not narcissistic. It is. I'm, I'm just, you know, well, I, I just... I can't live my life to celebrate you. I celebrated you this summer. I celebrated you. What do you mean you celebrated me this summer? To be there with you, to help you. I. Well, I know, I would, I would. I'm John Luann. It's enough. I'm the only one around you guys that doesn't have a child. And it's like, it's, I feel inadequate as a woman. I don't feel like I've done something I can be like proud of like afterwards. Now I'm like, maybe I'm just not gonna happen, I'm gonna but, but, adopt. But, 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 but a lot of people, More many people it. don't have kids, have very full lives, are very happy. Do you really want it or do you want it because you think you should want it? Because, and it's not a bad, there's no bad answer. I'm programmed as a woman, as a daughter of my mother, to think that this is what I want. I also know that when I have been a mother, which is to my chihuahuas, I have been the most loving and in there, and I know I could be you a great mother. That, well, she wants to embrace that part of her life. Not, perhaps. It's how I can relate being a mother, is to having my chihuahuas, whom I think I look exactly like. I really honestly, for the first time in my life though, do not right now want to date, even right. though I know I've got the time clock and the whole thing. But right now, I always go from one relationship to the next. Like that's what well, I've that's always done. That's a great decision, done. but if the kid thing is worrying you, then maybe but you should have a kid. So why can't you do it on your own? She's very possible. adamant about you. Guys, why? You can't have it all, lady. You can try, but you can't. Right. You can try. Right. But well, when, I'm still when, trying. Well, when the clock's ticking, you gotta... But I, you know what, because for, it, first step is I do want to be in the committed, loving relationship that I've always wanted. But you just said wanted. you don't want to date. You don't want to right date. Right now. Because it's just So now you're going to lose another six months. Exactly. At your age, you can't do it. I know Tinsley's a lot like me, we're traditionalists, but you know what? She is running out of time. She is 43, and sometimes your old thoughts should be rebooted. I think she has to rethink this really seriously and really quick. You, you gotta really figure this out. You either gotta jump in and go for it or jump in and have a baby on your own. Make, yeah, this is, a, you're actually, I don't envy this decision, to be honest. Tinsley's a little bit like Peter Pan. I know that you don't wanna grow up and you don't wanna deal with this inconvenient conversation about fertility, but like, not everybody's Halle Berry and Janet Jackson. So if you want to have children, we gotta get cracking. Okay, the man is not the, the, the decision, the baby has to be a decision. I know. That's I mean, the only thing. I guess that's the we, problem. We don't have time to wait for a man to get the baby. 